Hello, hello, guys! I am Jack Tricken and be welcome to my channel and let's talk about Halloween! And guys, this is my video, uh, which is a resume, uh, a review, a full review about the, the, the hero. And that will be actually a really fast video because uh, <laughs> you guys will see that. So uh, watch this video until the end to understand what I have to do. Okay, what I have to talk to you guys. So first things first, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to see more because I have another videos about Halloween. One explain the skills uh, and I will make videos uh, using Halloween on Guild Boss, using that on Gear Hides. So don't miss that, okay? Take a look. Uh, so that's it. Uh, and the best thing about Halloween, watch this. Guys, she's a healer that is considered the best healer in the entire game. Uh, some players say she is the best hero uh, of all classes in the entire game. Yes, so make sure to, to try to get your Halloween as you can. I, she, uh, as she comes to a banner, try to summon that if you don't have it because you will not regret. You can use Halloween as a healer in almost all contents of the game. She's very versatile. Uh, she can heal a lot, she can heal uh, outside his range, and she also can debuff, uh, clean the buffs, right? And the best thing is the rage regen for all the team. So that's what makes Halloween uh, a really, really amazing healer and also an amazing support, amazing buffer. So, yeah, uh, I, I have no words. Basically, uh, if you have Halloween, uh, you can use that as your main healer in almost all contents of the games. Of course, there is another good healers in the game for some specific uh, stages. But Halloween can do really great in almost all content in the game. And yes, so if you have a question uh, how good Halloween is, yes, she is that good. <laughs> okay, so um, you definitely want to have uh, Halloween six stars and uh, full skills. Let me show the skills. Uh, this first skill here, uh, it's not that important, of course. So I just save some stones here. But uh, this skill here, it's important, but since the cooldown is not too much, maybe you can save some skills, um, some skill crystals. Uh, if you don't have that enough, okay, uh, I have to do that because what you really want for Halloween is this one. This one, Nature's Favor, you want to get that full because it's really important. Restore Rage every 3 seconds for all allies equal 3% of the Rage cap. You want this at max, definitely you want. So be, be sure to use your crystals here uh, to get that full. And about the ultimate, of course, uh, it's nice to have that full. But it's not that important because she already heals a lot uh, and the dispel is really important but it just don't really really help because uh, all you can have here is more initial rage, uh, more uh, skill cost reduction uh, which you don't really need so you can use your crystals until you have that skill here full. And after that, you are free to stop. And of course, if, as you get some extra crystals and don't have another heroes to use, feel free to use a, and upgrade everything here. Okay? And here uh, is the gear the, that I have on Halloween. So I think, of course, uh, if you use this invigoration, it's really good. So I use it like that attack, attack, and attack. Uh, because the healing is based on attack né, here. Uh, and here I use uh, two salvations. Uh, as you guys can see, uh, she needs to have a small amount of HP just to make sure she will stay alive. The most attack that you can do, of course, death is not too much important for, for Halloween. Uh, the attack speed, of course, is really important because she can uh, heal everything uh, more fast, right? Don't need crit hate, crit damage, and healing effect for sure. Uh, try to get some. Just for the sets, you can get already uh, a lot of uh, healing effect. 
And of course, if you can get some extra substats, it will also helps. And Rage Regime, it's another thing that will be great, because like that you can do uh, more ultimates, right? And as an artifact, uh, I use it, it's Elysian, uh, because can help to do uh, more strong healing. And of course, you have some options. Uh, this one, for example, is a really good artifact, but he, he starts to work really good as you have that plus 25. I don't have that yet, so like that, uh, just buff 30 uh, speed. Each sec 60 seconds for only 15 seconds uh, doesn't help too much. So uh, if you have to, uh, plus 25, it will be much more. It will be, I, I don't know, don't remember if 30 or 40 seconds. So it's really good. But for now, uh, this artifact here works really, really great. Okay. And about the Awaken, the Awaken just uh, don't really help here. Uh, but of course, uh, since you, you, you use this hero for the last of the game, uh, I think it's okay to awaken. This one will help for sure. Um, yeah, dispel for just 20%, I don't think it's good enough. Rage Regime, it's okay, but you can just plus one, right? And obtain a, a wooden elf immediately after using Nature of Grace. That can help her for sure, but it's on Awaken 5, it will take a lot of time, right? So the first one here, after using uh, reduced damage taken by 20% for 10 seconds, doesn't really help. So yeah, you don't need to focus on get uh, two of that, right? So uh, yes. And that's it guys, that's the video of Halloween for today, and I hope you guys enjoyed that, and of course, thank you for watching, and see you in the next video, bye bye!